morning, good day, good evening, good night, good afternoon, whenever you're watching. Cool mountain rain. You have rain water, you have cypress, and you have oud. What you all? I'm in a oud type of mood on these midsummer wind down nights, which is exactly what this scent remind me of. Now my clips are a little bit choppy, so work with me here. Um, in my bedroom, this candle it gave me glacier mist vibes. You know that spa like with a little touch of cologne quality that glacier mist gave it's teetering along the lines of that and it did okay in the bedroom when i said okay i mean like it's seven right and i always tell you think about the dial on the stove when it comes to projection we're teetering at a low to medium uh when i stepped into the bathroom did i get a little bit of it yes it wafted in lightly uh but over in the bathtub couldn't smell a thing Got back into the main part of the bedroom. Did I smell it? Yes. Into the walk-in closet very faintly across the recliner. Very, very faintly. So I'm like, okay, well, it's a seven. It's good back here. I think I can live with that. And then I got to, you know, that... Dun, 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 dun. your mind playing tricks on you all my houstonians you know about ghetto boys and i'm like my spotty senses is tingling me and i gotta go to my inspector gadget mode and as i got to inspector gadget mode i saw this in the store and i thought about dark amber oud you all look at the clips above dark amber oud has that oud wood it has that rainwater and i and there's a different wood note there now here's the thing with these woods you know when it comes down to cypress when it comes down to cedar wood, sitting up against oud wood to the untrained nose, you will not know the difference. This is why I'm glad Glacier Mist had eucalyptus in it because the eucalyptus popped up to let you know I'm two chains. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. Other than that, you would, you would group them all in the same wheelhouse. So over here in the smaller room where I can encapsulate the scent and see what it's really, really giving, uh, it's still sat about a seven, you all. That's a seven and throw projection we got from low to now we're at a solid medium. It did not meet me at the door. It did not teeter out of the, the beauty room door. But nonetheless, it did well in there, and it's a nice, soothing scent. So... Unlike your glacier misses and your things that have lavender, I'm like, but you still feeling familiar. Check the clips above. I really feel like this is spa day that finally came into fruition from the test line. Um, again, when you change out that cedar wood and you knock it against that oud wood and you change one note with those woods, again, you really won't know the difference, y'all. And then I went back and I dug and I asked Instagram about rain drenched leaves. Kind of similar, but you don't got that spiciness of the leaves in the aquatic note. And then I thought about, um, what's the other one? Not rain, afternoon rainfall. It has that base, but this one just has a little more depth. You all, I feel like, again, this is spa day reinvented for anybody that wanted spa day. This might be the closest that we're going to get to it. Now, here's the thing. You're going to see me pan out here in the living room. When I first burned this candle, the first two burns, it did absolutely nothing for my open concept. Um, this is why I don't do initial burns because I was ready to come to y'all and tell y'all it's a no. So this is about six days in. I make the in my hurricane vase, my makeshift hurricane vase from Walmart for $5 because I ain't paying $25, $35, $45, $50 from QVC. I don't care who make it. Homeworks, nobody, all this, all that. This is not for me. Five dollars Walmart is gonna get you. It's gonna give what it need to give. Okay, so it capsulated the scent. It pushed out and moved through the air beautifully. And again, I don't mind it on my midsummer night wind down when I'm getting off from work and I just want to relax. So I still give it a seven out here. It's still a medium. So what that's prompting me is I don't need another. No, no, no. Because between spa day, glacier mist afternoon rainfall if you blend like me you're really not going to know that this is so much so different so again i don't need another but it is enjoyable so if you like about a medium and throw and well a medium and throw a seven and throw a medium in projection this will give. If you want a soft, soothing, sexy note for the bedroom, this will give. We're teetering along that cologne line that uh, Sea Salt and Sail had with that aquatic note. We're teetering along that cologne note that uh, Surf Shop had with that aquatic cologne note. 
You see what I'm saying? So it's up in that realm of that. Uh, there's no lavender there, you know, like you got some of your aquatic notes that they have lavender, but this is still very soft and very soothing. And again, I'm enjoying, but it's just going to be a one and done. And I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Bye.